Okay, here's the reason, real reason I wanted to put a receiver in this, the new toy. Uh, there's a northern uh, tool outlet that's closed here in the neighborhood. And uh, for a very short while, they handled these uh, plows that were made for S10s and little Ford Rangers. And as you can see, it's air right there on the top is the air compressor, it's all 12 volts. And uh, of course it has like a joystick uh, uh, controller. And uh, I thought, oh boy, that's gonna work on my Electrac. So I took the six foot blade and took a torch and cut it down to a four foot. And um, I'm just gonna uh, demonstrate how it goes into the receiver and then show you how it works. Now, you're still recording? Yeah. Okay, this is me putting my pants in order, sucking my gut up for my public. Okay. Hey, so here, I'm ready. Here we go. Okay. Okay, here it is. I, uh, this is the reason I wanted a receiver in the front, and uh, I'm going to use this for several accessories. Uh, what I'm going to do... Uh, obviously, it's made for universal application. So, I'm going to, once I get it out on the ground and I know where it is on the tractor, I'm going to adjust the height. I'm going to reduce this distance, maybe kind of change the bracket along so I can bring that air compressor right up close and it'll be uh, easier to, uh, it'll look better for one thing. So, what they do is they run power supply right from the compressor. There's a pressure switch on here. And then they've got a little control that turns it on and off. And uh, the compressor only works, what they do is they're using this main beam in the back here that uh, for the air tank. And so as you use the air, uh, it recharges that tank. So that's the only time that the compressor comes on so here, let me get this out of the way. So I've got this thing on right now. I've got it hooked up to 12 volts. And um, like I said, I'm going to trim this all up so the center of gravity is placed back forward and stuff. So it's on. Uh, check this out. Up, I mean down, up. Left and right. In and out, a little snap will take care of. Oh boy, so there, what's going to happen is uh, uh, these uh, clevises are a little crude, so I'm going to straighten those things out so that everything's tighter and works well. And uh, other than that, it works great, actually. So uh, I'll be able to sit on my seat and uh, operate this thing. I was just bragging to my cameraman here that uh, these things were marked down from $2,500 to $200 for everything. How is that for a thrill? I understand that uh, in the wintertime, uh, air is uh, a little harder to use because of the, uh, it compresses the water out of the air. So uh, that might be a problem. I might have to dry the air somehow. I don't know. But anyway, it'll it's uh, I'm playing with it and it, it's uh, cheap enough that it should be fun so uh, the next report will be how it works on my tractor 
like this, you know, in here, yeah. and then or zoom out or something, and then go so that it is included. That's the way Steven Spielberg does it when he's working on his electrac. <laughs> ¶¶